Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Siberia Mission Norway and Wonder Attack and your battle stations. Blow shit up. Look out! Good shot. And because of the game's difficulty for arcade mode is set to easy, this won't be any problem. Heck, I mean, none of these should be any problem, and that's how I wanted it. I didn't want to get stuck on any of these for any dumb reason. Pretty much just keep watching the radar. The magnetic mines that are a pain in the ass. Spiders coming in. So you have to divert your attention. Good shot. Oh come on. And when I was a kid, I mean, I really liked this game, even though I could never finish the whole thing. And uh, back in elementary school, I used to, kind of nerdy, I used to make up my own little games. Usually, like, on paper, you do stuff. And I'd make them and have my friends play them out. And I kind of made one based off of this game. I took a lot of the things in the beginning part of the game, the things you can do, like the barrel, and you walk across the, the oil and you slip, and... A few other parts in this in the beginning part of this game. I wish I could find them somewhere, because I actually like drew out maps of the the things and it was just a dumb little thing I did for fun. Nice kill. I mean the friends that I shared it with, I mean they enjoyed it. They thought it was kinda cool because I mean they never actually played the game, so they didn't know what to expect. Damn mine. Good now you can only take so much damage. You can see down there at the bottom, the green meter. Uh, that's actually... What's the green meter, actually? I can't remember. Oh, the green meter is like your shield. That regenerates. But once that's fully gone, then you start to lose the, the blue ones. And that's your, that's your... That's your... When those are all gone, you blow up. <laughs> you lose. Fucking hell, come on. Too low for me to get. Watch it! Magnetic mines. Dead silence. It's like, come on, where are they? This part takes forever to get through. Good shot. Do 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 do. Seriously, is it over? No. I can understand like a split second of silence, but come on there, I'm sitting there for a good five seconds of just nothing in. happening. Yeah, yeah, I know. Watch it! Everything's totally visible on your radar! You can totally tell where they're gonna come from. Fighters coming in. Look out. Nice kill. Nice kill. That should be done soon. Is that it? All right, thank God. That was amazing. Kiss me. Oh yeah. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh yeah. Santos is pissed. He's like, oh fuck no. Hmm. Get him, right boy. Get that son of a bitch. <laughs> oh. Don't tase me. No, he's still out. Search the hovercraft and see what you can find. And send Gia down here. Ah, you're awake. 
No use struggling. You're not going anywhere. That's right where I want you. Now maybe we can talk about why we were attacked. But I don't know anything! What are you doing? You're killing him! Yeah, and I wanted you to see it. You're sick. Hey, what are you doing? No! Stop it! Hey. Oh. That seemed off. It was lagging a little there. And luckily you get freed. Damn. Poor Gia. Oh well, better her than me. Oh! Huh? And then, you actually need to turn around and... Because first time, I went off and... I wasn't armed. So when I needed to kill the guys that came, uh, came up later, I couldn't fire and I was wondering why and I realized, oh shit, no wonder I got disarmed earlier. Now there, you, I believe if you went left, you can find this one thing that, if you scan it, it arms, and then it has like six seconds before it explodes, and you have to run. And there's no point in going over there, so I'm not going to bother. And for this part, right here, I just could have sworn that I was going to die here, just randomly, something like, I don't know, the ladder breaks, or someone shoots me, or something, because you never know where you're going to die in here. And that just totally looked like it was going to be one. Now, if you didn't kiss Gia, you'd have an easier time. You wouldn't have to go through all this part right here. But, this is more interesting. As soon as you come through the door, you quickly need to lock the door. Because if you don't, someone comes up from behind and shoots your dumb ass. And you also have to peek around the corner. He's escaped. Got it. If you just walk straight out, you get shot. And then she has to just time this right. Got him. It's kind of hard because you have to wait pretty late to actually shoot him. You can't shoot too soon even though you already see him. This buddy here is going to come up. You have to time your walk. Come on, make it easy. Oh, wow. I got really lucky there. Usually he's a pain in the ass just because he's such a fucking chicken. He never pops his head out so you can never hit him. But uh, that went pretty quickly. And then what did I do the first time? Oh, I just said, oh, I'm just going to get on the plane. And I thought, alright, I cleared this area. What the fuck? And that's what happened. <sighs> uh, let's see. Which one is it? Rough ride. Because you're actually <laughs> supposed to check. Pretty much after this, I checked everywhere I went. Because, oh, here, what's this? Fucking bomb on the damn ship. I mean, seriously, why? And you got a bunch of different scans you can do, thermal, this checks for biomass, whatever, but this is the most useful one here, doing an MRI. There's a couple of these sequences in the game. And then you get, like, a bunch of nonsense, which half of it doesn't even matter, it just makes it look all fancy. I like that one there, on-off switch. Okay, let me just simply click it, Ink. Of course it blows up, it's not gonna be that easy. Now, normally this would look a lot more complicated, but because I have it on easy, it's ridiculously easy. I've got three buttons to press. You click that, and you click that. On medium or hard, obviously it'd be a lot harder. But I wanted to just keep it simple. And now it's safe to get on the plane. And that's it for the first part. This part does actually take too long to get through. Now we're going to hit the flying missions, more shooting parts. And for the place, and for the PC version that I had, it only did the first three missions and the game cut off. And I, I didn't know that it was going to do that. I never did go get the other one, so I never got to finish it back then. Like I said, not until I got the PlayStation 1. And we're going to pause it here because I believe there's possibly another video sequence or the actual mission is going to start. So next time, we'll start the flying missions and get our way over to Siberia. So we'll see you then.